Hi Collective, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Earth Angel 111. So I have so many love messages. Usually when I do it, I have to split it into two halves to read them for you guys. So I'm gonna try something a little different. I have this box here, so I just fill them up and we're gonna pull a few love messages this way. Drop it in the comments, let me know if you like this. Of course I shuffled before I pull and I can't see, so we're gonna see what comes out. Okay, so first message out. It says, I've never felt this strongly about anyone ever. And do remember this is a collective general reading, so just take what resonates, okay, and leave the rest. So your person off the hop, they are incredibly attracted to you more than they've ever felt for anyone else. So this could be something that's a little bit intimidating, overwhelming, but most importantly, like incredibly exciting. Best kisser, yum. So your person thinks that your lips is luscious. Um, they could really enjoy kissing you. And for others of you, if you haven't kissed yet, this person is fantasizing about how great of a kisser they think you're going to be. Secret getaway. Okay. So either you and your person are planning to take one. And if not, they could be planning this behind the scenes. Especially if your person is someone who can't like outright come out and... and um, be in a relationship right away. Like, for example, if you or your person is someone in the public, um, for others of you, maybe you or your person just want to keep this relationship more discreet. However, it resonates, this person could be planning to take you on a secret getaway. And for others of you, this could just be to have you fall deeper in love with them. Breaking your trust broke my heart. So your person knows they could have let you down in some type of way in the past. This could be why they're planning a secret getaway, possibly just to like really make you feel good. The holidays are coming up, so this could be sometime around Thanksgiving, Christmas, Halloween, however it resonates. Um, especially too, if you live somewhere where it gets cold in the winter, right? They're like, hey, let's go away somewhere warm, just the two of you. So this is someone you haven't spoken to in a long time. This is gonna be quite a surprise. This could be someone who hurt your feelings and you've totally removed yourself from this situation, right? says, let's go out for dinner together. Yeah, so your person could love to take you out for a nice meal. They could also know that you're someone who enjoys going out to a fancy restaurant for dinner. Um, for others of you, it might be where they're going to ask you if you want to go on a secret getaway. I'm going to pull all the cards and then I'll let you know what everything says. So no one can take your place in my heart. Is this how your person feels? They've never been so into someone, okay? I keep hearing that Paramore song, like, I'm still into you. And after all this time, I'm still into you. So maybe you've known this person for a long time or you guys have been separated for a long time and they feel like no matter what, the two of you are completely in love. Can't keep their eyes off of yours. So this is someone who makes a lot of eye contact with you. They're incredibly drawn to your eyes. And they find you to just be incredibly attractive in general, okay? This is someone who gets lost when they are staring into your eyes. They're feeling, like, so captivated by you. Aw, so it says, I'm following my heart, and my heart leads me to you every time. Every time I try to run away, my emotions get the better of me. I love you. So you're dealing with someone who could possibly have ran from the feelings that they feel for you. They didn't want to admit it to themselves, but it's like no matter how far away they pull, they get pulled back by this feeling they have of this deep, intense love, this feeling of knowing that you and them are meant to be in a connection together. It says, I thought you just wanted to be friends. So this is someone who you could have came across to possibly that you just wanted a friendship with them. Maybe this is what hurt their feelings. Maybe this is what broke your trust as well. You could have been feeling more. And they could have taken it as you were just being overly friendly, whereas you could be more low-key, right? Being like, nah, I was into you. <laughs> and this person took it as, oh, well, I just thought you wanted to be friends. And you're like, nah. You guys feel this mutual feeling. So at this moment in time, your person's admitting that they can't understand their own emotions. I feel like this is the type of person that's a runner. You guys are dealing with someone who like runs away from your connection and then ultimately gets pulled right back. One more message. Please stop ignoring me. Unblock me. All right, y'all. Well, this looks like this is someone that you could have blocked and walked away from because they hurt your feelings. They feel like they broke your trust in some type of sense. 
Maybe they started dating someone else while you were attracted to them and they thought you just wanted to be friends so they didn't realize the depth of how much that was going to really like break your heart, like destroy your heart. I feel like for some of you, maybe you've just really not dated anyone since. This person can pick up on it now. Maybe there's been a bit of time or distance or space between the two of you. I feel like this is someone you could have not seen for a long time, okay? Months, a year even, couple of years, take it how it resonates. But your person is realizing now that they always were in love with you. They just didn't know if you felt the same. They thought you just wanted to be friends. So to get over you, this person could have tried to date someone else. And ultimately, that relationship did not work out. And they keep getting pulled and pulled back into your energy. Because this is someone who knows at the end of the day, this could be a soulmate connection or a twin flame connection. And when you're twin flames with someone, it doesn't matter how long you're together and then separate or how much distance between you or other people. There's nothing that can separate the two of you from having this undeniable love and chemistry towards each other. And yeah, I feel like maybe you and your person both tried to date other people to move on. When in reality, it's almost like if you found this reading today, you just got to be honest with your feelings for this person as they want to be with you. It looks like they're holding in a lot of love for you that they could have possibly never even expressed. Okay, so this is going to be significant for someone if you know that you deeply never got to share how much you fully were in love with someone because they felt the same. They just didn't want to be, you know, giving away too much of how they felt if you didn't reciprocate the same feelings. And maybe you were playing a little nonchalant with them, so they thought you just wanted to be friends. But yeah, this is the type of person that wants to take you away. They want to go somewhere romantic, just the two of you, and really explore how deep this connection can go. And I'm talking deep, okay? <laughs> I'm surprised that one didn't come out from the box. But yeah, your person seems like there's someone who very much holds their feelings close to their chest because when they reveal it, they fall head over heels in love. And this is exactly how they're feeling towards you. So I wouldn't be surprised if you kind of reached out and they just unloaded fully how they're feeling on you because for a lot of you, you could have this person blocked. So they're feeling like they're not sure how to communicate with you. Um, you could have them blocked on social media, via phone. For others of you, this could have been someone you never even gave your number to, okay? You just had them on social media and you knew them here and there, right? So they could have always just thought you wanted to be friends because you guys never made the move. Okay, there you go. So for a lot of you, you guys never made the move to let them know you were fully interested. So all this looks like one misunderstanding, okay? Like you could both be mirroring each other at this time that you both want to kiss each other. You both feel su super strongly about each other. But neither of you ever made the initiative to say, hey, do you want to go on a date? Or like, hey, are you into me because I'm into you? Or giving each other each other's numbers? Stuff like that, okay? And for others of you, if this isn't an online thing, this could be someone you know in person. But it's always just, hey, hello, how are you? Or hey, what's up? For others of you, this could be a coworker, right? So you never went as far as to try and date them because you didn't want to ruin the connection or the relationship. You know, I don't know about y'all, but I'm definitely this way. And I know there's other people with the same sense where like if you're working in the same field as someone or you're in the same job, you don't usually want to date someone where you work, right? Because you don't want to create problems in the future. I feel like that could have been the vibe that you gave this person or that you both gave each other when in reality you both actually wanted to be in a relationship and it's like there's a lot of hidden feelings between the two of you. So this is someone you haven't spoken to in a long time. Maybe you're no longer at that place of work anymore or they're no longer at that place of work or for others of you, one of each other's got someone blocked. Okay, so they're like, would you unblock me and stop ignoring me? Okay, so this is a friend of yours who really at this moment in time is feeling like they want to tell you how much they love you. So if you found this message today, open up your heart, okay? I think you're going to get a surprise reaction because this person feels the same way that you do right now. Thank you for watching. Until next time, bye!